Whanganui is an historic river city on the west coast of the North Island of New Zealand. It is close to the national parks with their native bush and mountains in the centre of the island. Whanganui's small size of around 45,000 people means residents enjoy a relaxed lifestyle in a safe and secure environment. Whanganui High School is the most popular and successful government school in the region. Its large size of over 1,800 pupils means students have excellent facilities. As well as English and International English, students select a total of seven subjects from over 60 available. Art subjects include painting, art design, drama and dance. Languages include Spanish, Japanese, Chinese and French. Ça c'était excellent et vraiment intéressant. Merci beaucoup Richard. International students are well supported. Mrs. Tonya Huben looks after all administration. The principal, Mr. Gary Olver, and assistant principal, Mrs. Jenny Langrish, support the department and regularly meet with students. Miss Alexandra Ferretti is the director. She oversees the department and enjoys helping students reach their full potential. Mr. Jos Burkholt is the dean and looks after the day-to-day -day pastoral care and class placement. Hi, my name is Emily and I'm from Germany. Hi, my name is Chess and I'm from Vietnam and we are hot sister. Yeah, that means we live together and it's a lot of fun. <laughs> and for example, after school, we go to Virginia Lake and we have some ice cream or milkshake <laughs> and we can like put our music and dancing all the time and like people look at us, why do it go so weird? Yeah. That's what we do. And um, what I also do after school is I'm in stage challenge, which basically is dancing a story on stage for about eight minutes, I think. And it's really cool. And we're three weeks away from our performance. And yeah, so first it was a little boring for me, but I really got to know more people. So yeah, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> um, with me, I normally after school and I go to the library or maybe go to chat with my friend and having some sushi. The end is very fresh, not like in Vietnam. It's like big pollution over there and it's like kind of annoying but because my hair is not good so I cannot join stage challenge with her. Yeah. I am G. Uh, I'm from Brazil. I've been here in Wanganui since 10 months ago and one of the things I enjoyed most here was the different lifestyle because I'm used to, I'm from a big city, so I'm used to like um, having a really busy life, having lots of stuff to do. So when I got here, one of the things I really liked was that we are, people here are more relaxed. So you have more time to do what you like and have fun and kind of enjoy your life better. So that's one of the reasons I really like go, coming to New Zealand. Living here in a homestay and you get really well accepted and you get, and they're taking care of you. So it's really good. Students are placed with local families by the school. In a homestay, students have their own room. Sometimes two international students are placed with the same family. Many international students choose to take an outdoor education course. The course has trips almost weekly, including sailing, trekking, including the Tongariro Alpine Crossing, where students look down into the crater of a volcano. Kayaking on the Whanganui River. And high ropes, among other activities. 
Wanganui High School is a great place for international students as it is close to the real New Zealand.